he is not alone. He's not the last. I understand his excitement and his wish to immediately meet the others, to free them and wake them up. But he has agreed to wait a bit longer. First, he's going to try and help us. If we make it to the conference, the Dark One will be able to open up the thoughts of Moskvin, or Corbut himself. Perhaps make them stop this madness. This is our last chance. Artyom, we already knew of Oktobriska from Khan. And we did confront Moskvin on this, yet he didn't even try to disprove it. He told them by sheer luck their chemical defense squad was exercising nearby. And thus, despite some sacrifice, they were able to lift this starting epidemic in its blood. Otherwise, it would have engulfed the whole of What can you say to that? Even I would have done the same. But come on, it was Lasnitsky, the agent who stole a virus container from D6 right before the outbreak. So what? There is not a single living witness besides Artyom. Who'd believe the order? We have the D6 now. What if it was us who released the virus? But the Reds start to break through into Hans's territory. We could make Moskvin. What can we do? We are not an army. We've less than a hundred fighters. Yes, sir. Yes, Moskvin did gear up for war. But after Polis suggested that we share the wealth inside D6, he might actually agree to peace. We must do everything to have that agreement signed. Mostly. What difference does he make? He's just a puppet in Corbett's hands. And while he's talking, Corbett's forces are encircling you. You'll seal this peace agreement with your blood! What? You got a better idea? You brought this ape here! What now? We're done with this. Let's go to the Council Hall. Follow me. Permission to report, Colonel. Denied. Urgent dispatch to D6 Security Force Commander. Go to highest alert. Instruct Korneyev to proceed with... Well, he knows what to do. God, please let this work out. Close to the little one. Hurrah, comrades! Let there be peace in the name of our children! You are a liar! Kong, are you out of your mind? I know what I'm doing. Just believe in me. Just this one time. Who are you? Guards, take this man away. Ranger, stand down! Artyom, little one, it's your turn. Comrade Moskovin, you must support me on this. Or else, some inconvenient details might surface concerning your brother's death. I overheard one conversation between your brother and his advisor about the threat you pose and ways to eliminate it. What's the hell? Threat? We're brothers! He thinks you feel bypassed, cheated. He fears you will overthrow him. <laughs> He's totally mad. Totally. I'm going to give him an earful. Words alone will not avert his assassination plans. No, you must strike first. Mm. 
Maxim. Brother, I'm so pleased that we finally made up. It was a fight over nothing. Let's have a drink. Sure, brother. What? It is your honor. Maxim will be the new Washington. The new Secretary General. Silent treatment. What are you looking at me with those honest eyes for? It was your fault. Who wanted me dead? Corbett sold you out. And now, he's got me by the balls. All because of you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, brother. There's no forgiveness for me. But even so... Just like I gave something to brother. Yes! Yes! I did. I poisoned him. And Corbett. I'm a fool. I thought he wanted to save me. And he just took the power. Took me by the throat. And he's storming the D6 now. And there's that virus. And if that falls into Corbett's hands, the end. But you are the leader. Order him. Call the troops back. You stole them at least. Buy some time to make a deal. There's nothing more we can do here. Hurry. Faster. To the platform. Damn them. I'm not surrendering D6. Follow me. It will be bad for everyone if you lose? Then I will ask for their help. 